Hey guys and welcome to a therapist task guide sanitary standards part one for this task we're going to need to find one gas analyzer in raid and then hand it over to her don't forget to leave a like on this video if you find this guide useful so starting off if you don't have the best rng the best place realistically if you don't have rng on your side is to head over to the hideout and go to the workbench tier one I am crafting something so I can't show you directly what it is but for the craft you do need four AA batteries, one GM counter, two magnets, four bundles of wires and then one elite pliers. Now to create one of these is it does take you 17 odd hours so if you do need to get all three of them for both of your um, sanitary standards this is going to take you three or days to make. But I am going to show you in raid a few different locations where you can get some gas analyzers. So for some of the locations that can spawn in are the toolboxes that are dotted around, technical supply crates, sports bags, the ground caches, so the barreled one as well as the covered one, as well as dead scavs. So I am going to take you around a few spots inside of Interchange. Currently, we are over here in Oli. Now, Oli is one of the most reliable places to actually get gas analyzers. So, they can spawn on these shelves that are just at the front right here. As well as make sure you check every single one of the shelves that go out to the back, like these kind of things right here and um, those over there. So, basically, they can spawn anywhere on where there are green shelves, just like so. They can also reliably spawn inside of the tech stores so texco like this one or texho like this one is a pretty decent one also heading up the flight of stairs directly in front of us tech light is another great location that can spawn more gas analyzers but if we head back down these wonderful escalators and pull it around to the left we have rasmussen just in front of us right here coming into rasmussen there are a decent amount of spots as well for them to spawn as you can see there are shelves everywhere inside of here and then what we're going to do is head up past Kiba. so we are here just about Kiba. on the left hand side is actually brutal these shelves right here so you can see there are more green shelves there are green shelves dotted around here as well as these metal shelves just here can also spawn some gas analyzers but continuing making our way just past Mantis right here, we have one of the final tech stores, which is German. Inside here is a, well, a tech store, so they can spawn inside here. And if we continue running the entire way down to the end where TTS is, uh, just up ahead here, go in through the main entrance and then follow it around to the left hand side. You can get tech items that spawn on all of these shelves right here, like so, as well as just here. Oh, here you go. A wonderful gas analyzer as you can see <laughs> if you are struggling with this task or just in general wanting to find people to play with head over to prana.tv slash discord we do have a decently large looking for group community as well as a sherpa system so if you just need a bit more help than normal then we are there to help you Hopefully you guys found this guide useful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe or possibly consider joining the channel membership where you can unlock early videos as well as a few custom rewards. Don't forget to check out Piranha.tv as well. That's a one-stop shop for all of your guides, tasks, keys, all those kind of things in one location. Hopefully you guys found this guide useful and I'll see you in the next video. And a big thank you to all of my Patreons supporting me over on patreon.com slash piranha TV. And a huge thank you to Jay Dam, Freddy, and Beansy. Without this kind of support, I wouldn't be able to do what I do.